Hi guys, welcome to ET's Tindin channel and in this video I'm gonna give you a quick tip on how to make ginger garlic paste at home. It's really easy to make and it's used in so many different Indian recipes. It's very handy to keep it in your fridge. So let's go ahead and start cooking. So for this recipe we are going to use equal parts of ginger and garlic. I'm using one third cup chopped fresh ginger and fresh garlic and we are going to grind them to make a fine paste and for preservative we are going to use uh, white vinegar and turmeric so two tablespoons of white vinegar and one teaspoon of turmeric now turmeric not only gives a beautiful color to the paste but also helps uh, prevent the discoloration and acts as a preservative so transfer ginger and garlic in a blending jar and simply add two tablespoons of vinegar and one teaspoon of turmeric now if you don't have vinegar you can also use lemon juice and also if you want a little help in grinding um, ginger garlic you can add one tablespoon of oil but no water so our ginger garlic paste is ready look at it nice consistency you can put this in the fridge and it will last for two three weeks you have to put it in a airtight container so clean glass container and just transfer your ingredients and place this in the fridge and if you want to put it in the freezer you can use smaller containers this is my previous batch that i had made i did not use any turmeric in it and uh, small quantity it was put in the freezer now a few things to keep in mind while making this ginger garlic paste is that the container the airtight container in which you are going to store it should be absolutely dry also do not use any water in this recipe we don't need any moisture and every time you take it out of the fridge refrigerator take the portion out that you need for your recipe and store it back again quickly and the last and most important thing to keep in mind when handling this ginger garlic paste is that always use a dry spoon do not take it out with a dirty or a wet spoon so now you know it all Go ahead, make your own ginger garlic paste and enjoy.